Hi, Children's Literature class. My name is Ellen Hammond. Um, my maiden name is Ellen Perry. I am coming to you live from South Jordan, Utah. I recently moved here from North Carolina. Um, our family lived there 15 years, and that's where I had all my children. Um, I'm originally from Austin, Texas. I grew up there, and I love the South. Um, one thing that I like about myself is that I'm fiercely loyal to my family and friends. My husband and I met swing dancing in college um, doing Lindy Hop. So Lindy Hop is a form of swing dancing from the 40s and I love the 40s. I love the fashion. A lot of my favorite uh, books are from this time period. My first book takes place in Nazi Germany. It is The Book Thief by Marcus Zusak. It is a beautiful tale told from the narrator death about a little girl Liesl. Uh, it is a tale of humanity's light and darkness. My next author, Antoine de Saint-Exupéry, wrote in the 1940s with his fable and fantasy, Le Petit Prince. The relationship between the prince and the rose captured my imagination as a child. It inspired me to take French in high school and college. A contemporary realistic fiction that I enjoyed is Rainbow Rowell's Eleanor and Park. I like the tender teenage relationship and the, the raw emotion. A folktale that my boys asked me to read often is Caps for Sale, a tale of a peddler, some monkeys, and their monkey business by Esfer Slobokin. It's a charming tale and the illustrations are perfection. In elementary school, I loved reading the Serendipity Collection by Stephen Cosgrove. These books were accessible to me. My mom had the collection, along with some other books, on a small bookshelf in our downstairs bathroom. Another middle grade series is The Great Brain by John D. Fitzgerald. It's realistic and historical fiction. It still makes me giggle. Um, Tom reminds me of my brother John, who would swindle and con um, my brother James and me who were younger into all kinds of adventures. Another book that my mom kept really accessible to us was the Macmillan Dictionary for Children and I love that it's readable to uh, all ages because you can read the pictures and read simple words and as you get older you can really dig into some of the details. A favorite book of mine for the youngest audience that comes in board book format is Jamberry by Bruce Deegan. Babies love it and they can chew it when it's in board book version. The Warriors series is a middle grade um, chapter book collection. I put this in here because my son sets his alarm clock 30 minutes early every morning so he can get up and read these. So he's in a reading war with his cousin my niece who's eight and he's nine and they love these books and it gets kids to read so it's great. Press Here by Hervé Toulé is my last book. He also wrote Mix It Up and Let's Play. It's a very tactile and artistic and expressive experience to get into his book and it is such an interactive experience that uh, it brings out the, the child in all of us. So thank you. It was wonderful to meet everyone in our class and I'm excited to learn with you.